Good day everyone, this is Michelle Armaginis. Um, today I am going um, to uh, make a video documentation of the of uh, featuring the different tourist spots uh, in the Philippines and here are my um, output for uh, this um, documentation thing I choose is the this one and I have here the um, picture one which is the Amontay Beach Resort uh, located in Carmen Agus and Del Norte this is uh, one of the famous um, uh, tourist uh, destination in Butuan because of the um, nice beach you can see um, you can see a uh, uh, you can also there there is a pool for the uh, kids and adult and there are uh, there, there there is some like um, cottage uh, near the seashore the second picture that i choose is the sm lanang in lanang davao city this is uh, one of the famous or tourist destination in davao so uh, most of the uh, uh, tourists there is they went to this uh, mall because I think this is the biggest um, uh, mall in Davao, the Isim Lanang Mall. And I choose the third one is the Manlangit Nature Park in Alubihid, Butuan, uh, Alubihid Buenavista, Agusan del Norte. Um, this is um, one of the tourist spot also in Butuan. When, so so um, this is... Um, uh, what do you call this one? Um, uh, overlooking uh, at the uh, overlooking place, especially at night, you can see uh, a whole part of Butuan City. The fourth picture that I choose is the El Salvador Divine Mercy, in, located in Cagayan de Oro. They said that this is uh, a miraculous uh, place. So. So everyone went there because uh, sometimes they will pray and they were asked for something and he said that when you pray um, heartily, uh, of course God will grant all your heart desire. So uh, this place is famous uh, uh, because of that um, belief and, I, and it's also a nice to see that statue behind me and it's a good thing in real and then I choose the fifth uh, picture the Kagwait uh, sorry called this or uh, this one is famous also a uh, uh, famous tourist destination in Suriko because of the white sand and the good waves especially when it's um uh, windy season the sixth one is I choose the Davao butterfly house and yeah, this is one of the best spot also or tourist spot in the Vow. You can see uh, a thousand uh, kinds of butterflies there, and it's good to see uh, that there's still a lot of butterflies that I have been uh, seen before. And the seventh one is the crocodile farm in Davao City. Also, there's a lot of or I think thousands of crocodiles there. And the eighth picture that I choose is the Amaya uh, View Resort uh, in Cagayan de Oro City. Also, this said that, or that, um, uh, like something like a sign that it's said that uh, this is the highest uh, peak uh, in Cagayan de Oro, the Noah's Ark. And to be exact, this is the Noah's Ark at the Amaya View Resort. And the ninth picture that I choose is the Alunakiyo Beach Resort located in Bohol. As everyone knows, this place is um, quite uh, good and the hotel is good because of the white sand, the uh, 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 famous uh, um, and the um, hospitality of the, uh, the staff in that hotel. The third picture that I choose is the Sagbayan Peak uh, in Bohol. So, where you can see uh, different types of species, animals, and um, it's like a sanctuary there, and it's a good also. And the eleventh picture that I choose or spot is the Mac Arthur's located in Tacloban City. 
Yeah, so be sure when you be there in Tacloban, be sure to visit uh, the Mac Arthur's Park. And then, the San Juanico Bridge. San Juanico Bridge is a bridge that connecting the Samar and Leyte and it's been there for uh, three decades now. And it's a nice uh, place to be there and when you stand on that bridge, you will you will see what I'm telling now so be sure to visit San Juanico Bridge when you when you be there in Tacloban City the th 13th picture that I choose or spot is the El Nido Palawan well this is one of the best um, tourist spot in Visayas because of the nice beaches and the uh, coral reefs and it is also one of the tourist des destination of, for the scuba divers and then the 14th picture that I choose is the Regency Hotel in Boracay. This is a famous hotel in Boracay because it's like um, in the uh, Hawaii. You can see the Haiti dance there in the Regency Hotel. So uh, it's like you're in the um, tropical area like in Hawaii. You can see there's uh, uh, dancing uh, on the beach during night. And our oh, good hand, what do you call this one? The fire dance. Uh, that's the fire dance. The 15th picture that I choose is the Manisha, Manila Ocean Park. Manila Ocean Park is famous in um, different kinds of species in the underwater. And there it is a big aquarium. This one is the big aquarium and uh, all the people is coming there to see this uh, kind of uh, species underneath the water. And then the 16th one that I choose is the Taal Volcano. They said that Taal Volcano is one of the um, tourist spots of the Philippines. And still, this is active volcano. And it was erupted, erupted uh, recently. And because of the lake, this is the lake and this is the uh, volcano. Um, so, that's the reason why it became famous and one of the tourist spots also in the Philippines. And then the seventh um, picture that I choose is the Baguio Night Market, where everyone uh, they uh, they will visit. Uh, when uh, most of the people visit in this place because of the what you could call bargain or uh, cheaper compared to the uh, normal market. And as they said, this is um uh, and. Uh, it, uh, the people there is they didn't sleep at night because they, they sell their product during night and uh, eight, uh, the eight and picture or spot that I choose is the Madawi rice terraces it is a man-made um, uh, terraces and this became uh, famous because of this a uh, hundred hundred hundreds uh, like layer of um, uh, these things also uh, you can plant your um, or you can plant your rice there that's why it became famous because it is a man-made uh, terraces the 19th picture that I choose is the Manila Cathedral Manila Cathedral is where uh, there's a lot uh, in the history there is a lot of events uh, held in that church and, and that's why it became uh, famous in Manila and then the last um, tourist spot that I choose is the National Museum. National Museum, it, it is where all the um, exhibit or the uh, paint that our um, national uh, artists uh, put together or they make an exhibition and uh, they make exhibition and they're um, posting or uh, they hang their um, masterpiece there. So I guess um, this is my um, output for the documentary video featuring the different uh, tourist path of the Philippines. And thank you and good night.